On Friday, 155 students participated in graduation ceremonies at the Carl D. Perkins Vocational Training Center in Johnson County. But these students and their families celebrated much more than you first realize. So about 24% of our, our population is autistic. Uh, we have a number of students who have physical disabilities um, as well as intellectual disabilities. Um, some of our students attend Big Sandy Community Technical College and um, have 36s on the ACTs and some of our students struggle to read. So we really do have um, the, the entire range of um, students. So they could come here, uh, live, receive uh, residential services, receive vocational training, as well as any ancillary services such as um, speech therapy, physical therapy. Students receive certificates or diplomas in many different areas from cosmetology to building maintenance to child care development, which was the program that helped fulfill a lifelong dream for Bowling Green resident Shelby Huff. I've always dreamed of going to college and getting a degree, but with the struggles, I didn't feel like I could go. When it came senior year of high school, my counselor told me about Carl D. Perkins. I've always dreamed of teaching, so I chose the child care program. I worked hard, I did struggle, but with the help from my teacher, Ms. Spencer, I passed and I'm off doing what I love. I came home with it and within two weeks I found a job in a daycare. I was, first I was like nervous, you know, I didn't want to leave, but I overcame that and felt um, more accomplished than before I even started. I felt just like everything had come together. A lot of our students haven't spent a lot of time away from home, um, so they come here for the first time, they make friends, um, they live on their own or they learn how to live on their, uh, their own, they learn the, um, all of the idiosyncrasies that are associated with dormitory living. I'm just very proud of the class I'm graduating with and the one before because I got to watch them walk the line too, so I'm proud of everybody that comes through here.